What's going on everyone? CBS Strange IV here today at Wizard World Con. We're gonna get some videos, uh, we're gonna check out some books, hopefully find a few, and uh, you know, just have a good time. So stick around, check out the video. footage I apologize I didn't get much more than that but um, overall the con was it was mediocre at best I paid too much to get into a con that didn't have a lot of books or a lot going on but I still managed to find some good stuff all right so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna show you the things that I picked up and then that will be it so uh, basically this whole whole haul that I have is just a, a couple horror books. There's uh, one, two, three, four, five books total here, and they're all horror books. So uh, if you've been following my channel for a while, you know I collect House of Mystery and House of Secrets books, and that is the majority of what I have here. So starting with issue 120, we grabbed uh, House, House of Secrets, issue 120, and then... I was also able to find issue 150 and uh, I've not changed the bags on the boards yet on these I'm looking uh, to hopefully do that soon I'm gonna be putting a lot of these in mylar hopefully uh, just got to get some none of the local comic stores around here sell it so I have to order it online um, and then moving over from House of Secrets we're gonna go to House of Mystery and uh, I was able to pick up issue 188 and uh, I believe that's a Neil Adams cover there, if I'm not mistaken. Um, grabbed issue 192. And then, rounding off those uh, DC horror books, we got issue 218, All House of Mystery. So, I got one more book to show you here, and I'm super excited. I went in uh, to the con hoping that I was going to leave with something along the lines of this. And I was able to track it down, or track a book down, that was in my price range, and in uh, sort of a shape that I was, you know, willing to, to go ahead and buy it. And I know that I'm not going to be picking these up for, uh, you know cheap if I'm wanting to get good grades but I got this at a, at a relatively good price and it is my first uh, pre-code horror book so I'm super excited about this but I grabbed The Haunt of Fear and it is issue number 15 uh, pretty cool cover there and you can see that it's not in the greatest shape you see the spines a little wore down here but I'm going to try and have this thing pressed and cleaned and I'm probably just going to end up slabbing it just because I think it'll eventually be worth it uh, just to see if um, what grade it comes back at and then this is probably something I'm just going to keep in my collection unless I can upgrade it later on but super excited to finally get my first pre-code book here so I'm hoping the rest of this year you know I'm not going to go crazy but I do want to grab a couple more so I'd like to get about four or five of these books a year uh, but we'll see what happens so Overall, like I said, the con wasn't the greatest, but I did feel like I got a decent haul. I bought some stuff that I like to collect. Um, I was hoping maybe to run into a Turtles issue 3, and I still haven't. Uh, I've been hunting that book for a little while now, but eventually it'll pop up and I'll be able to get it. Uh, but that is it. So, gosh, uh, thanks everyone for checking out this video. I appreciate it as always. Um, I hope that you like these comic book videos. I know I've been doing a lot of figure stuff lately, but I'm going to try to get back into a weekly comic haul and or some sort of comic related video. Uh, but anyways, that is all that I have. So thanks for stopping by. Thanks for checking out this video. Hope next week at the same time I'll be able to post another comic video. But we will see. So appreciate it as always. And uh, please like, please comment, please subscribe. And I'll talk to you all later. So stay cool, everyone.
Thank you.